Welcome to Finances2DPool.com, your ultimate destination for financial education and analysis. In today's video, we will explore the techniques used to analyze the financial positions of companies, helping you make informed investment decisions. So, let's get started. Introduction to Financial Analysis Financial analysis is a crucial process that allows investors, creditors, and stakeholders to assess the financial health of a company. It involves examining various financial statements and ratios to gain insights into a company's performance, profitability, and overall financial position. Financial Statements The first technique we'll discuss is analyzing financial statements. Financial statements provide a snapshot of a company's financial activities, including its income, expenses, assets, and liabilities. The key financial statements include the balance sheet, income statement, and cash flow statement. Balance Sheet Analysis The balance sheet provides information about a company's assets, liabilities, and shareholders' equity. By analyzing the balance sheet, we can determine a company's liquidity, solvency, and ability to meet short-term and long-term obligations. Income Statement Analysis The income statement, also known as the profit and loss statement, showcases a company's revenues, expenses, and net income over a specific period. Through Income Statement Analysis, we can evaluate a company's profitability, growth trends, and operational efficiency. Cash Flow Statement Analysis The cash flow statement tracks the inflows and outflows of cash within a company during a given period. By examining the cash flow statement, we can assess a company's ability to generate cash, manage its operating activities, and fund investments and financing. Ratio Analysis Ratio analysis is another powerful technique used to evaluate a company's financial position. Ratios provide insights into a company's performance, efficiency, and overall financial stability. Let's explore some key ratios. Liquidity Ratios Liquidity ratios measure a company's ability to meet short-term obligations. The current ratio and the quick ratio are commonly used liquidity ratios. They indicate whether a company has enough liquid assets to cover its short-term liabilities. Profitability Ratios Profitability ratios assess a company's ability to generate profits relative to its sales, assets, and equity. Examples of profitability ratios include the gross profit margin, operating profit margin, and return on equity RE. Debt ratios Debt ratios provide insights into a company's leverage and its ability to handle debt. The debt-to-equity ratio and interest-coverage ratio are commonly used debt ratios. They indicate the proportion of debt in a company's capital structure and its ability to meet interest payments. Investment ratios Investment ratios help assess the attractiveness of a company's stock for investors. The price-to-earnings ratio, P-E ratio, and earnings per share, EPS, are common investment ratios that evaluate a company's valuation and its profitability per share. Conclusion In conclusion, analyzing the financial positions of companies is a critical step in making informed investment decisions. By examining financial statements and utilizing ratio analysis, investors can gain valuable insights into a company's financial health, profitability, and stability. Thank you for watching this video presentation on the techniques used to analyze financial positions. We hope you found it informative and helpful in your financial journey. For more in-depth financial education, visit our website at www.finances2dpool.com. 
Remember, knowledge is the key to financial success.